Ladies, stop scrolling. Please, it's now time to put yourself first. Give yourself a little bit of you time. Now, Shelly also felt that way, but she didn't really know how and what direction to do that until she came across an advert very similar to this one. THQ really does help all walks of life, all ability levels. Now, Shelly is just a few years off 50. She brings up three kids alone and she's making massive progression towards her body transformation. She's been a THQ um, um, Ashbourne member now for a number of months and she's making really, really good progression. So, and she realized it was really time to sort of spend a little bit of time and money on her and how that's actually gonna benefit the whole family as well. So Shelly, thanks a lot for taking the time to do this video today. No problem. Um, so yeah, so let, let's hear your story. So what's your experience been of THQ Ashbourne so far? Well, really good. Like I say, Matt's an absolutely fantastic trainer. Um, obviously nerves when you first start but then seeing all the advertisements over Facebook um, I sort of researched it a little bit I know a couple of friends that had been coming to you and that I saw their before and after shots which obviously is a great deal of uh, uh, improvement in the photos so obviously it made me very interested and um, it's just been really good the well, the people that come through your door are down in Ashbourne are just normal people, so I don't feel uncomfortable or on edge or anything at all like that. Yeah. So it's really good. That's brilliant, brilliant. What sort of things had you done before before you came to THQ? Um, I've, you know, I've done a lot of cardio, um, I, I, but I haven't been to the gym for a good two or three years, really. Obviously, with lockdown and everything. But I did do a lot of cardio and was finding, I suppose you put it down to age as well, that I, wouldn't, I wasn't losing weight. I wasn't sort of toning like I wanted to. Um, so I, that's why when I saw all the advertisements, I thought, well, it's the sort of thing that I wanted to do and have the courage to do. So I'm a netball coach as well and I play netball myself. So I do do cardio, I walk a lot. And nothing seemed to alter my body shape at all. It just sort of stayed as it was, or I gained weight, to be fair. Mm. So, yeah, it's, it's yeah. been really good. It's a very common thing. And that's what we try to educate people to, to like, be able to achieve with weight training as well. Because weight training, generally, when we get you stronger, you actually use the food that you're actually consuming more. And that's how it helps you, you drop body fat. And, and with cardio, we do need bits of cardio for for a heart rate and stuff like that. But like, to be honest, like if, if you carry on, if you like um, run for 20 minutes, your body gets better at that. And then you start to then burn less calories and then you start to eat, eat more as well. So it's not, but that's probably why so in certain areas you maybe have found that you put weight on before doing cardio exercise. So did you have any worries about starting, like with starting lifting weights before or anything or before you yeah. start? Yeah, to be fair, I, I, I am tall. I didn't, and I always think that when you're tall, people, they always say you look big. So to me, that word, I hated. Um, so I wanted, I, I didn't want to go in a gym and feel like that I was out of place or that, you know, you got all the people that were pulling weights and you were, weren't doing it correctly because obviously you don't know how to do the technique um nerves really as well because obviously you go in there there's a lot of slim people um young um and it, so really they were my main worries really to just look out of place which at hq down at ashbourne there's just there's such a variety from young to older body shapes all different body shapes but they're all just so friendly and make you feel so welcome really? so that's what i like about it really yeah brilliant and that's yeah and that's good and that's good for people to hear as well because it's sometimes taking that first step into the unknown isn't it and we don't know and and it's like yeah it, that's what we really try to do at thq is to make it a really nice in, um, environment so all walks of life and all ability levels can get results with us as well so did you have was you worried that weights might make you bulky or anything yeah like that? definitely yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely but then i think when you you do get a little bit older over 40 there's parts of your areas of your body that you want tran you want to go back to what they were and they don't seem to go back to what they were but i have found doing the weight training it's really toned and changed the shape of my body obviously i've still got loads that i need to work on um but yeah it's it's just been something that i've never thought of doing 
and it's it's definitely worthwhile because I, I can't believe the the inches I've lost and you know how how different you feel energy levels everything really yeah brilliant yeah the whole the whole transformation in it the feel how you feel day to day as well so how have you found the structure of the meal plans obviously we're, we're big on giving you that structured advice for your food as well yeah I mean obviously I, I have to be honest about this I've got three children one of them obviously doesn't live with me at the moment she's off at uni um but I have tried to follow it as better as I can obviously a lot I'm sure people are more religious than me but I tend to cook my meals because obviously I'm cooking for the whole family I calorie count and I try to put as much in without going over my which I don't normally I try to stick to them religiously but I have to say my meal planning is more day to day I know I should probably put a bit more into that area which I will do now I'm going to do the shoot but yeah. you try and work it around your family life so what I didn't want to do is have such a structure that I knew I couldn't stick to whereas with the HQ you've obviously you've got your calories you tell us what we should be eating which obviously you can add to your foods anyway uh, so I'm at the moment I do need to work on that so I can't say that I'm, I'm best at doing it but calories yeah from the beginning of me starting I've tried to track my calories um, just for my own peace of mind uh, and obviously you know you don't want to lose momentum no yeah which which a lot of people find you know they can you can easily do that can't you yeah, 100%. Down. Yeah. And it's like, yeah, you don't have to do everything at the start. And to be honest, if it was like, if you was going to do everything perfectly, like, we wouldn't have a job. So No, well, that's so, it, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, as long as you're... And you've got, you've, got to, you've got to be able to work it around your family life. Yeah, 100%. So, because what I was worried about also was if, if I do a planned food for me and then I've got planned for my little girl and then I've got planned for the, my teenage, you know what I mean? And I thought, is it going to be too much for me to get into my daily day but anyway it's it to me it's working well because I'm losing weight I'm toning up but it is an area that I do have to say I've got to probably progress on that yeah. area yeah and, that, and that, I mean that's the coaching aspect to it that's the obviously we give you all the, the all the advice that what you should be doing on a daily basis and then it's just making gradual steps that fit into your lifestyle to make sure that you're getting that return on your investment so you're actually progressing over a period of time um, but it's got to like I say it's got to fit you and it's got to and that's why we keep it a very small gym small amount of people so that yeah it's great that is because great. that's the other thing what i really like about it because it's more personal because the most there's is six in the class and so you feel like you're getting a proper um you're properly looked after and you know you're getting the the coaching that you need to do obviously uh, with just six in the class it's just it makes you so um relaxed you know, you're not coming into a great big group of people uh, and each, it just, it is a really nice environment down there. Brilliant, yeah. Now, so let, let's talk, touch on a little bit about the exercise because obviously um, a lot of females do worry about sort of going into the gym and knowing what to do. So how do you find the, the way the sessions are structured, the support that you get as well during the session? Really good, really good. Because obviously Matt, uh, he coaches, he's, he's a, a nice, constructive, quiet coach. So he, he like, uh, he knows, so he always asks you what problems you've got. So he, he, he obviously changes some of the uh, things that I have to do because I've got a problem. I've had a broken knee and a broken ankle. So there's things that I need to just alter for me, which he, he obviously does. Um, yeah, he, it's just really good because the structure is there. Uh, but also you can tweak it if you feel like you have got an injury that you're probably worried about think you know well if I pull a weight I might make it worse but yeah. I'm finding with my issues the more that I'm working the stronger they are so they're actually improving yeah yeah 100% yeah, which they will do as you get stronger as well and your, your food gets yeah. better and you get consistent. Yeah, it definitely will do. So, yeah, no, that's brilliant. How do you find the check-ins outside of the gym as well? We communicate with you outside of the gym. Is that how? Oh, really good. I probably drive Matt mad, to be <laughs> fair, because I am the sort of person that's always like asking questions. So uh, he probably is sitting there at weekends thinking, oh, my God, not her again asking a question. But he always answers straight away. Yeah. Um, 
you know, he's just on point with everything. Um, I, it's like I say, what's nice about it is that you can ask those questions and you don't feel uncomfortable. And you, I mean, even in the class, it doesn't matter because people are so normal that you can be just yourself. Yeah. Instead of sitting back watching the, you know, I've been to gyms before and I've just felt uncomfortable and not enjoyed going. Whereas now it's like basically my social life, really, to be fair. <laughs> No, but that, no, that's really, really nice to hear. And yeah, with the check-ins, that we want to be known for getting people results in. Like, so we want people to marvel us. We want that. And that's why you'll always get a fast reply because if, if it was like, say, if it was easy, then we wouldn't have a job and we want to be known as getting the best results in town. So um, that's, you know, that starts with asking your, answering your questions as well. So how much weight um, have you lost? What's your, how much clothes sizes? And uh, I've, I've lost over a stone. Marvelous. I've gone from a 14 to a 12. Um, I've lost just over 15 uh, inches in total over all my body. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'm really, really chuffed with that, to be fair. Still got a lot, what I would feel a long way to go, but obviously that's the old uh, thing of doing it, isn't it? You know, it's got to become part of your life as well. Yeah. It's definitely. making me yeah. aware of what I'm eating because obviously you do get a bit carried away and forget what you're consuming. Yeah, but yeah, but body weight wise, like I said, I've still got. I'm still, I'm, I'm progressing, but I'm very happy with where I've got to in in the time that I've been there. Yeah, definitely. Brilliant. And that's that's where your motivation and your your, your motivation is going to come from. So if you feel that you're actually accomplishing everything, and um, then you're going to keep making good progress. So yeah, so you joined the six week program, and obviously there's never any pressure to stay on after, but you stay on you stayed on after. Um, what's your sort of plans now for THQ with you? You mentioned the shoot. Yeah, I'm doing the shoot. Um, yeah. And then obviously after that, I want to be able to maintain my body weight and shape. Obviously get stronger, which like I say, I have got injuries and I am quite sporty. So I've found that those injuries have like lessened. Uh, like I say, the stronger I've become, the less weak my knee feels when I'm like stepping down something, whereas before it was a bit uneasy and felt like it was going to give way. Uh, and that's definitely strengthened up. So uh, hopefully, like I say, keep progressing, um, toning up, obviously. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm, like I say, for me, it will be long term because I enjoy it. It's social for me as well. And like I said, with the groups, groups being so small, it's like friendly as well. So it's it's somewhere you can go. It's more like going out for me, if you know what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah no. That, 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 kids, you haven't really got a social life, have you? Yeah, no, no, well, yeah, no. <laughs> I'm the same as well. Um, but yeah, no, that, that that's actually, it's brilliant to hear that as well. And to give people a bit of context, we like we, we do the six-week programme and then like there's never any contract with us. And if, if you're enjoying it with us and like what you obviously are, then people get the opportunity to, to carry on um, and do different programmes of inside the gym as well. So um, what advice would you give to anybody that's thinking about um, joining THQ? Oh, go for it. Yeah. Because like I say, for me, I, I, I've been through lockdown like we all have. Boring, you know, you are walking, which I do a lot of, walking the dog, but it was becoming monotonous. And I've found just going to HQ now, it's opened up, you know, I've made friends there. Uh, so it's social. Um, and it's something that I haven't done before because I've always, like I say, I have been a bit of a cardio person. Um, but, you know, pulling weights, you just associate, you see the big people in the gym and uh, you're overwhelmed by them. So you sort of like, don't do your weights. You go on like a cross trainer or something like that because you're feeling a bit out of place. Whereas you go down there, you, you show the technique of what to do. I mean, my, my, what I'm pulling weight now is from what I was is extreme. Like my, um, uh, I'm doing my leg curls now. I think I'm about up to 144 on that. Brilliant. Uh, and on my uh, hold, narrow hold, I think it's, is it 155? Yeah, yeah. Um, so the progression from when I started is amazing. But my nemesis, the thing that I have really, Matt will tell you, has drove me mad that I couldn't do, is a pull-up. Yeah. Honestly, it's what I kept saying to him every week. Oh, my God, I can't do one. I can't do <laughs> I've got to five now. And 
That's it's been it's been the one thing that from when I started the gym, I really, really wanted to just do one. Yeah. And I couldn't do it. And and, and now obviously I can. That's I'm nice. still obviously five's not a lot, is it? But for from where I was, where I work, I couldn't even do one or even half of one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I think no, that's that's incredible as well. And I think the health benefits as well that you'll get as a female as well is, is actually getting stronger. Like a quick Google search will allow anyone to understand the because for for males, it's very simple for males, like we have a slow decline in testosterone, and that's about it. But for females, hormonally, we have so many, well, you guys have so many different things going on that if you actually get stronger though, and you actually build a decent amount of muscle, that's going to really improve your health as well, definitely as we get, as you get older. So um, as well as that, obviously be able to do pull-ups as well. It's you know, very well, very well good for your health as well. Um, yeah, definitely. So yeah, so yeah, basically that's all, all I want to do. Anything else you want to add, Shelley? No, just if anyone wants to try, you've got to go for it because like I say, you'll really thoroughly enjoy it and don't feel that you, you'll be overwhelmed because honestly, the ages there are just across the board and weight training is it's really, really enjoyable. It really is. Yeah, because you're and, actually Yeah, and like just being a few people in the class, there's five apart from you. It's just like I say, there's no you don't need to worry because uh, we're all, all normal down there. <laughs> yeah <laughs> no that's absolutely brilliant absolutely brilliant so guys if you actually are interested in joining the next six, six week meltdown program we start at the start of each month so it's coming up um, at the start of next month um, just click the link below have a look at some of the female body transformations that we've achieved as well um, and obviously hopefully Shelley's put you know, a lot of your worries at, um, at ease as well for actually being able to to make good progression with us so yeah click the link below um, we'll send you some more information on the program it's just by clicking the link it's just to finding out more a little bit more information we'll send it to you and if you want to come into the gym and have a chat you're more than welcome so guys thanks for listening hope this helps and hopefully i'll see you all soon take care thank you